Before the Hindenburg, there was His Majesty's airship, R-101. The biggest airship in the world at that time, she was to be the flagship of the new global airship network. So luxuriously was she outfitted that people called her the Titanic of the skies. As she voyaged among the clouds, stewards served lavish meals in her dining room, where lamps glowed on snowy white tablecloths and potted plants. Passengers strolled along her promenade deck, whose wide windows overlooked the landscape passing below. The window curtains were dyed Cambridge blue. The insignias on the uniforms of her crew were embroidered in gold thread. Like the Titanic, this majestic airship set off on her maiden voyage, carrying distinguished passengers. And like the Titanic, her end was catastrophic. Airship of Dreams is the story of one man who boarded that fateful flight in October 1930.